So Conor Hughes, you're back in Switzerland after being here in December last year. I think you have now more time to see what the club is about and the surroundings here. Uh, what are your thoughts until now? Uh, I feel like this is going to be a very competitive group uh, moving forward. I mean, this year and uh, moving forward, they got a lot of good guys, a lot of uh, depth this year. Um, and, you know, it's it's run really well. The coaching staff and uh, the outside staff too is incredible, and uh, it looks it really looks really good for the future. You started your summer training with uh, Michael Lawrence in Canada, I guess. Yeah. Uh, you trained there with uh, Sandro Turkirken. Uh, what are you working in particular right now? Um, you know, just a lot of the mental game as well. I mean, it's a huge jump uh, going up to the NLA. It's uh, one of the best leagues in the world. So, I mean, probably just focusing on keeping up with the speed here um, and then refining all the little things, you know, eyes on pucks, tracking them right into the body and uh, rebound control, stuff like that. You signed a four-year deal with uh, Ambry. I think it's kind of a development deal. Uh, this deal shows the commitment to your development from the club, but from your point of view, it's also a bigger commitment to sign a four-year deal. Uh, what are your motivation to, to sign a, so long, a, a deal so long? Well, you know, just talking with the staff and uh, the players here, it just seems like a really good organization. Yeah. Um, you know, it's a you know, great place to play. Um, so I, I didn't see why there was any other reason to, sh to sign a short year deal and uh, you know I just have to work hard and hopefully uh, you know live up to expectations that they have of me. The deal that you signed there is uh, this thing that um, Ambry or Biasca can call you back if uh, they need a goalie. Yeah. Uh, do you think that you're gonna follow the Swiss league a little bit more, more closely in the, in the next year? Yeah absolutely I mean uh, I followed it, you know, decently last year, and that now I'm gonna follow it uh, quite a bit this year. I know I can't watch it on TV, but uh, I'll be kind of looking on the news and seeing how everything's doing. I made a couple good friends here, uh, Zuri, and uh, you know, a lot of other guys. So I'll be kind of following along, talking to them, and just seeing how Ombre and is doing. Uh, in the last year, we saw a trend to see uh, more big goalies. We can see, we can see that you're yeah. you're one of them. Uh, what can you tell us about your style of play? Um, you know, I think it's uh, efficient. I try to stay uh, efficient because you know the more you move around, the more time and energy is spent. Um, you know, if you stay uh, you know inside your net, try and make yourself big. Um, you know, it's going to give uh, players less to shoot at. Um, you know, and you know, I model my game off after Carey Price, and he's very calm in that. So, um, yeah, I just want to be a, be a calm goalie, big goalie who, uh, you know, uh, doesn't doesn't give a little player shoot up. Michael Lawrence told us that for you is important to develop a winning mentality the next year, and it's because of that that you're going to play in Canada one more year. Uh, what are your goals for the next season? Yeah, I mean, uh, last year was my first year of winning. Uh, you know, anything. Uh, huge so we won our league and now I want to continue that tradition and, and go to a team that is looking like they're going to win uh, hopefully a national championship so I need to learn how to play in big games um, play in big games and, and, and win right like you know it, you're not going to learn how to win by losing right so you have to you have to be in those situations before to learn how to win so yeah so what are your plans for the rest of the summer are you going to stay year long uh, I'm leaving this Sunday on the 14th and then next week on the 20th, start, 21st starts our camp in Carlton Place. We have uh, fitness testing and um, yeah, it, it starts pretty early so I have kind of a week off and then I'm uh, back at it again with my junior club back home.